All right, so in this video, we'll talk about the tweezer bottoms, one of the candlestick patterns here. Uh, and the ideal tweezer bottoms uh, looks like, uh, not exactly like this. Uh, there should not be any upper wick in any of the candles, only the lower wick, and the lower wick should not be uh, way too long, uh, should be equal or near equal to the body size. Uh, but I have mentioned here because uh, it's very rare that you'll find the exact kind of setup uh, in a light trading chart. So this tweezer bottom indicates the market likely to uptrend, go to uptrend after downtrend as we can see the example here. Uh, the market was in downtrend. So these two candles uh, we can consider as a tweezer bottom and the market went upside. So an ideal, as I mentioned, to your uh, bottom, there should not be any upper wick, only the bottom wick, and the body size of these two candles should be equal or near to equal. And most importantly, uh, in the tweezer uh, bottom, the lower of the body should be equal. If there is a little bit difference in upper side, that's okay, fine, but the bottom should be very equal, okay? It shouldn't be near equal. <laughs> And obviously, guys, there has to be a support. If not the strong, at least there has to be a small or minor support. Then only you can consider as a long opportunity here. You place a long order right up to the closing of this uh, green candle. Stop loss, obviously, below on this line, uh, the uh, lower wick or the at according to the resistance area. So this was about the tweezer bottom candlestick pattern. In the next video, we'll talk about uh, morning star and the evening star.